Hello guys, my name is Osango Amos. You can see here. My registration number on the course is B8 Technology Triple E. So today we are going to learn about a single phase transformer. And the objective today is the derivation of an EMF equation of a transformer. So first of all, I'll start by drawing a single phase transformer. This is the core. The inside the core we have a magnetic flux flowing presented by phi presented by phi then we have a primary turn primary turns then we have a secondary turns Secondary turns. So on the primary, we have a. This is the primary part. Primary, and this is the secondary. Then we connect here a voltage source, which is a sinusoidal voltage source. Let's call it V1. Then you have a primary current here which you call I, I1. Then inside we have an induced EMF. It's called E1. Then here we have an induced EMF. We call it E, E2. Then here you can collect we can connect a, a load. Call it RL. Then here you have a voltage. Call it V2, which is V out. Then, according to electromagnetic induction laws, the the EMF equation, the EMF, the induced EMF is given by N, which is number of turns, d phi, dt. First of all, this is the magnetic flux inside here and it's given by flux is given by m sine omega t this is the this is the voltage applied is a sinusoidal voltage then doing a differentiation and say n c is present number of turns so it's a constant then d brackets qm phi m sine Omega naught or over dt. Then, when you differentiate a sign, let's say let's take example example of uh, sine two sine two t. When you do a differentiation with respect to t, you get Two, which is the constant, then cos two t. So in our case, it's given by number of turns. Then this is a constant. Bring it here outside. Then this is an omega naught. Comparing with our two, we get omega. Then differentiating our sign, we get cos cos omega t. Then this is e. Then according to omega is given by 2 pi f. Then we can replace here it here. Repla replacing the omega in question one, we get 2 pi f cos omega naught. Then according to geometry. See that cos omega t is, is the same as sine omega t minus 90 degrees. But we can see here the voltage uh, the, the, the voltage is lagging. So therefore we can say the maximum voltage the maximum EMF generated is given by 
n phi m two given by that volts. But we want the voltage in RMS. So if you need a voltage in RMS, EMF, E in RMS given by N phi M two phi F all over root two. Then going further, say two F two pi F all over two root two. Then say frequency. This is N frequency. Then we we end up getting four point four four N F N. Yeah. So then according to the EMF. You want to given by four point four four F number of turns now in the primary and one given by then similarly E two is given by four point four frequency this is num number of turns the secondary part. The flux remains the same. Then we can do an example. An example. Example. A single phase transformer. Of two hundred fifty three thousand volts at a frequency a frequency of a frequency of fifty hertz. As a magnetic field, magnetic flux, flux so, so, of 1.2, and it has. And just an induced EMF of eight volts per per turn. So Roman one calculate calculate Get the primary and secondary secondary turns. Then Roman two calculate. So, first calculating so number of turns given by so we have a an EMF induced per per turn. Then you can say the n one is given by v one, which is which is which is three. It is three thousand. This is what we call v one. What we call v two. So then you can say v one. All over voltage per turn divided by eight. So you can see three thousand divided by 
8 we get 375 tons then the secondary tons and it is given by v2 divided by 8 so then we get as 250 divided by 8 So it's approximately that two tons. And so we want to calculate the area. The area. Then phi is given by Bm A. So for my equation, we can replace by M as B B M A. So is given by 4.44 fn 2 5 m so making a the subject of the formula a is given by 2 all over 4.44 so frequency is 50 times 50 so yeah, it was the it was two fifty and frequency times number of n two is that two times the net flux which is one point two given as twenty nine point three two and ten is to three meter square. You can also write it as zero point zero two nine three two meter square.